So I did something that I've always wanted to do since high school. I went to my very first K-pop idol group concert. I think you can guess which group I went to see. It's BTS. So I'm gonna put out two videos for this. One is more like a vlog of my whole experience um, going to the BTS concert. And then the other video would be just the concert itself, just all the recordings I did for all the music that they performed and kind of the highlights of each song. In this video, I'm gonna show you my vlog of my trip to New York and seeing the whole concert. And I also want to talk about um, my thoughts and review of the concert itself. Pre-BTS lunch. Man, so good. Got our half and half. Yeah. My outfit to the BTS concert. Thank you. And the other like 22? 22? Yeah. I love that. That live stadium! Woo! This is your concert! I made sure to do all my classes, even though I didn't get to BTS! BTS!
but you guys truly proof that that music transcends the language of the music. Let's clear all the genres for a second. Um, now, I didn't know this, so, but I really realized that this moment, and you guys are here, did become our religion. No, that was important. And really, the most important thing is, is this moment. You know, breathing with you guys, singing with you guys, is vibing, enjoying the same thing. This moment will forever be my journey. Thank you This moment we have our own lives for we can see countless lives in front of us. Now I want to please measure my channels. This time we have some folks up in the sky. about my thoughts on the concerts we were so excited we thought we uh we didn't want to miss anything so we just ran for it and found our seats and when we got there they were playing um you know bts hits and it was pretty much like a um turn up session for the crowd just to rile us up to start the concert they used different things that really helped um entertain us they had uh speaking moments that were really funny um they're just really funny uh personalities um, jungkook was lifted up in the air they had fireworks they had streamers blowing and um their dance was on point they moved around the stage in different parts and i really appreciated what rap monster or rm was saying about how music is something that could uh, transcend language and can bring people together. I really do um, agree with that. I think I really now understand why everyone are just hardcore fans of BTS. They are really just down to earth. Their music is undeniably great regardless of um, how they came up. You can't deny their music quality and the performance quality. You just can't deny it. And also what differentiates them from other groups is because they acknowledge that they were underdogs and that they appreciate the BTS ARMY fans that had stuck out with them from beginning to now. You can see where they spent their money for the concert and they spent it for the fans. They saved the best for last. They had a rising BTS um, ARMY logo. Um, light up and they put on a freaking firework show at the end and it was just spectacular and they thanked army for it um also jungkook cried uh, i didn't realize it was their last tour of um the u.s tour and yeah he cried and that just kind of like softened my heart a little bit this was probably the best concert i've ever went to if not the best concert i've ever been to in my life if they're going on tour in the u.s next year i'm totally down to go again i have no complaints it, it was an amazing concert i spent the whole time just dancing i recorded a lot of videos i i was able to sing along it was just a whole vibe a whole 
good, amazing vibe. Also, I want to mention the set list for the BTS Love Yourself Speak Yourself tour. Um, they did a really good uh, balance of different music. They have pretty much a balance of their solo music and also their turn up music. And I think for the most part, um, in terms of the group music, they picked really huge bangers and uh, fast tempo songs, which for me, it, it, it fits me uh, so well in terms of a concert experience. I love high energy. I love fast paced music. They picked all the bangers. They did Fire, Idol, Not Today, Dionysus, um, uh, You Are uh, Best of Me. Um, those are all kind of my favorite. Uh, style music and my kind of favorite songs and then for the solo music I think it was like a mixture of um, slow songs so they did spread um, kind of a balance of both throughout the whole concert and I like that there's that kind of contrast in the concert there's like the turn up music where you can just like everyone was just dancing to and vibing to and then there's like the um, more slower tempo music but also uh the you know music that are really great too so i appreciated both aspects and um that's what made the concert so amazing i want to go to a concert where i can just dance to i can just feel the music i could sing along to a little bit and just move my body i i like to go to a concert where i can just move my body freely and dance um to the music and bts did that and did a really good job with the set list for um this tour so i really do appreciate that too well anyways yeah that's just my overall thoughts on the bts concert it was just so amazing and yeah i just have a whole nother deep appreciation for bts and i can't wait to go more of their concerts i can't wait to go to more k-pop concerts now that i'm a grown-ass woman. <laughs> I'm making YouTube videos because number one, I recently or well, kind of recently quit my job and number two, I'm taking time uh, off to work on myself and to uh, find myself in a way that involves my mental health and involves my, um, my well-being and my wellness. So yeah, I'm doing YouTube videos to kind of um, to kind of help me reflect on my life and also help me on my public speaking and kind of be able to express my thoughts and I think yeah doing videos kind of vlogging slash journaling in this way has really helped me build my confidence and helped me uh, improve on my speaking skills so um yeah if you want to watch more videos like this and support me on my journey i'm going to be talking about a lot of different topics um that i think a lot of us are going through i've talked to my friends about some of the things that i'm going through in my life and a lot of my friends and a lot of people i know are going through the same thing so yeah if you like more videos like like this and you know if you want to support and I could support other people who are on similar journeys like me, feel free to subscribe and let me know your thoughts. Anyways, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye!